Music, they say, is food to the soul, as it helps elevate one's spirit, a universal language, and also be used as a weapon to transform the society for the better. In an interview with motivational singer Fumi Ayinke, she expressed her worries over youth restiveness in the society, saying rather than engage themselves in unproductive ventures, they should take solace in music. I'd like to talk to Nigerian youth that they should learn a lot of things from this woman called Fumi Ayinke. And I realize I'm not reading. They're not reading it well enough. The way I, the thing is not sinking into them when I write. So I said to myself, if you don't, if you don't read me, you sing me. And that's exactly what I'm doing right now. Instead of putting it as a lyric, as a write-up, I turn everything to song. And then we are all here today. So she challenged government to invest more in the creative industry, as it has the capacity to transform the economy of the country. I think there's always room for improvement and everything. And on my lane right now, as a motivational singer, I realize that there are not many in there. Some of, some of them are gospel artists doing worship and praise and that. Some of them are into Afrobeat and all that. But you have different people who want to do motivational. Your life is most big. And I tell to you, stay on your path, on your lane. Don't give up. Actress Yvonne Jegede believes Afrobeat musician Sheung Kuti is worthy of being celebrated. The mother of one expressed her sincere wishes for the son of Afrobeat legend Fela and Nicola Kuti as it turned 39. Jegede says Kuti is not just a friend to her, but a personality who is worth celebrating always. <laughs> Simon Coyle is to marry for the first time after secretly proposing to his girlfriend, Lauren Silverman. The 62-year-old X Factor star, who previously declared he didn't believe in marriage, got down on one knee during the couple's recent holiday in Barbados. Romantic Simon popped the question in front of the couple's seven-year-old son, Eric, and stepson, Adam, from Lauren's first marriage. Lauren was absolutely stunned and never in a million years expected Simon to pop the question as she burst into tears happy tears and obviously said yes straight away. The mogul worth 360 million pounds has been dating the stunning American socialite who is also a millionaire in her own right for 13 years. They have homes together in Los Angeles and London. Tragedy struck Nigerian entertainment industry again as Juju star Dayo Kujore has kicked the bucket. According to reports, the Juju music legend died at the Lagos State University Teaching Hospital, Lasuf, Ikeja, Lagos. Born on the 4th of April 1958 in Abel, Ogun State, to parents who were clerics of the African church, Kujore joined the choir in his local church and learned how to play musical instruments such as the guitar and the piano, which made him fall in love with music. Travelling Juju musicians who came to his village to perform at special events spotted the young Kujara's talent and invited him to join them during their performances, which he did. The deceased was popular with his Juju genre of music called Soko. 